The first step in the tile production process is the mixing of raw materials to form the rubber compound. Several types of rubber along with special oils, carbon black, antioxidants, silica, and other additives are combined in a mixer. Finally, we get the semi-finished rubber. The compound rubber are then sent to machines for further processing into the sidewalls, treads, or other parts of the tire. The various semi-finished products come together and are assembled on the tire building machine. This is done in two stages. First the casing and then the tread and belt assembly. The tread and sidewalls are put into position over the belt and body plies. And then all the parts are pressed firmly together. The end result is called a green tire. After inspection, the green tire is transported to the vulcanization process. Vulcanization is the last step to make a tire. The green tire is placed inside the mold and inflated to press it against the mold forming the tread and the tire identification information on the sidewall. The tire receives its final shape after being vulcanized for a certain length of time at a certain pressure and temperature. Every tire is then inspected. Finished hand-mixed tires go through visual inspection, x-raying and various tire uniformity checks.